Hi, welcome to automation testing that in. In this video, we will see Python data types Boolean means as part of Python data types, we are going to discuss about Boolean data type. So we'll see what is Boolean and we'll take one example to see how we can use Boolean in Python. So Python Boolean types, Boolean data type is to represent Boolean values. So what are Boolean values? True or false considered as Boolean values. So only allowed values for Boolean are true and false. These two are comes under Boolean data type. So internally Python represents true as one and false as zero. Okay. So when you take the same in Java or C sharp, so this is not the case. Their true means true, false means false. There it will not consider as true as one and false as zero, but in Python, true considered as one and false considered as zero. This is one peculiar thing when you compare with other programming languages. So we'll see some examples, whatever we discuss now. So let's go to Notepad++. So we are writing all these, all the programs in, inside the Python programs. So I'll create one file under this folder and I'll save as under the same folder. What is that? Boolean data type dot py. Boolean data type dot py. So first what I'll do, I'll, I'll store in the value. So let's consider a is equals to true. Okay. So true, you can see in different color. The reason is it's predefined value in the Python. Okay. And only few values starts with capital letter, right? That is true and false and none something. Okay. So I want to print this. So print of a. Okay, so I, I'll go to console and I'm under the D Python Python programs. So I can directly run this program. So Python Boolean data type dot py. When I hit enter, you see that the A is true, it is printing. I stored a Boolean value inside A and I'm printing A. But I want to know. The what is the data type of that A, whether it is exactly taking a, a Boolean or not. Uh, in the number we have seen that whether it is int or float or complex, right? The same way we will check the same thing in here also. So for that, what we need to do? So print, we need to use type of A. What is the A type? So I'll run the same command again. And you, you see that it's a bool, means boolean, right? So we are getting the correct information. Now we can use only true or false, how we can get the true or false values in some other way. So what I'll do, A is equals to 30 and B is equals to 40. I have taken like this. So I want to compare these two values then I'll come to know that whether the condition is true or false. Means true or false means it's a Boolean value. So I'll say print A less than B. A is 30 and B is 40. 30 less than 40 means it is a true condition. So we'll try to execute and see whether it is printing true or not. You see that the last print is true means A less than B. In this kind of scenarios also, you will get the Boolean values like, what is that? True or false. In the same way, you can do A greater than B. It is a false condition, right? 30 is not greater than 40. So when I run this now, you can see that the last value is false. So this is how you can get the values. So, and we discussed some of the 
things but that is very specific to python that true is considered as one and false is considered as zero so is that really true or not okay we'll we'll see so print i'll say true plus okay true plus true so when i run this one we'll see the output you see that it's two the reason is true is one and plus true is one one plus one what is that two so the same way we'll try something else print false minus false so zero minus zero will we will get zero you see that the last value is zero and the same way print true plus false 1 plus 0 1 we will get 1 you see the last value is 1 so in the same way we'll try something else we have said true plus true but i want to one plus true means this is a boolean value that is an integer value i am adding these two values is that possible we'll see you see that the last value is two means one plus true is one so internally true considered as one so one plus one what is that two so we can add this true or false to any integer or float also we will see 1.23 plus true again i should get 2.23 we will see you see that 2.23 can we compare true or false let's a print true greater than false is that correct or not internally it will consider as 1 it is 0 1 greater than 0 true then true greater than false will give you what true you see that true so this is how the boolean will be in true so true value will be considered sorry this this way we can consider as boolean values in python okay so the boolean values are true and false these two things will be considered in any language as boolean values and in python specially true will be considered as one and false will be considered as zero internally so that is the reason we are able to do true plus true false minus false true plus false false plus true and you can add this true or false to any integer or floating point all right and you can able to compare this true and false true greater than false or false greater than true even that is also giving you boolean value okay so this is all about boolean data type in python so thanks for watching this video please subscribe to my youtube channel for further interesting updates